Dive into the realm of innovation with us as we decode the secrets of the iPhone 16 Pro. Be the first to witness the revolution in smartphone technology and experience the thrill of groundbreaking features. Stay ahead of the curve and join us on this exciting journey. Apple iPhone 16 Pro New Leak Reveals Change to Key Hardware Feature The tech world is abuzz with anticipation as we inch closer to the fall. The expected launch window for the next generation of iPhones, including the iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro Max. While the official announcement is yet to be made, numerous reports and leaks have given us a glimpse into what the future holds. The latest revelation? A significant design detail that could change how we interact with our iPhones. The evolution of the action button. The action button, a feature that debuted on the iPhone 15 Pro and Pro Max models, is under scrutiny once again. This innovative feature replaced the mute ring slider switch, a staple on every iPhone since the first model. The action button introduced a press and hold alternative to the previous slide action, offering greater versatility and functionality. It can be assigned to a range of features, including one button access to the camera, magnifier, translate, and more, and can be configured to multiple extra capabilities via shortcuts. The future of the action button. Apple has been contemplating the design of the action button for the upcoming iPhone 16 Pro and Pro Max. Four button options have been under consideration, a unified volume button or distinct buttons as currently designed, and an action button that is either kept as is or increased in size. Additionally, the new capture button, expected to offer a shortcut to shooting video or photography and mounted on the opposite edge to the action button, could be flush with the frame rather than raised. Prototypes have shown various arrangements, but it seems that the latest version has settled on a particular pattern. This will have two separate volume buttons as now, and while the previous version included an action button that was capacitive touch, like the most recent Touch ID buttons on the iPhone SE, it looks like Apple has gone for a button which largely resembles the current one found on the iPhone 15 Pro. This suggests that the prospect of a capacitive action button has been put on hold for this year at least. As McRumors puts it, while it is currently unclear how this affects the future of Apple's work on a capacitive action button, a design change as significant as this indicates it has been cancelled or postponed for future iPhone iterations. The countdown begins. While things could still change, the time for hardware alterations is almost certainly ending around now, if it hasn't already. As we await the official announcement, these leaks and reports continue to fuel our excitement and curiosity about what the next generation of iPhones will bring to the table. Stay tuned for more updates as we continue to bring you the latest news from the world of Apple. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated with our latest content, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also, click on the bell icon to turn on notifications so you never miss an upload from us. Remember, your support helps us create more content for you. Until next time, take care and we'll see you in the next video.